let's let's go to Evermore and see about doing that and get that extra guy. That was that was really weird. That just there was nothing. Like that guy was just simple. I don't know. Okay. All right. So I do have that. I'll take this alert chief and close. Thank you very much. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, so what else do you want me to find? Not ordinary boots. Good quality boots and antique more with her new armor. Brutes boots of grade six or higher. Okay. Now that I might be able to make. Yeah, I can. Yeah, that's not too bad. Yes. Yep, here you go, buddy. <laughs> yes. Hey! So yeah. how did it go? Yay, I'm happy that she's happy. Ooh, Minty Gosh. actually smiled. <laughs> Congratulations, Fido. Yeah. The legendary armor, huh? And he wants to get the legendary weapon. Ooh, nice. <laughs> cool. There's another 30,000 Sphinx Gilders. Speaking of, how many do we have? Oh, wait, is this enough? Uh huh. No, it isn't. Not, not quite. It's really close, though. It's good. Take care of our stores. Okay, so I hear there is some research that got completed. Where is it? Who completed the research? You guys complete your research. Okay. The restore texture has been completed. Actually, hold up, hold, hold up a second. No, you guys are, you guys are doing something. Okay. Because I'm looking at how Ling, he has astro Astrologer's Gift, and it looked like the research done here. Astrologer's Gift. Okay, so we could get Spirit Medium next. We got that one mushroom, we can go look. I don't think I do. But we can go look. I may look sweet and beautiful, but its flavor's famously awful. So... I mean, I don't have anything that looks sweet and beautiful with bad flavor. I don't, think, I don't think we've gotten that yet. Now, we do have to go to the calm lands, to this, to, to the forest of ear or whatever it is, uh, because there is supposed to be a mushroom there that I have to pick up. Which I think is this spot right here. If I can find a place to freaking land. Earcrow, there we go. So there's supposed to be a mushroom here I have to pick up. If that's the one I'm talking about, but I haven't found the one for her, for the teacher. Oh, hey. Do something! Oh. Ah. Okay, okay, let's chase it. There's another one of those side quests we gotta do. I mean, we're knocking out the side quests. Like, really quickly, too. So that, that's a thing. We're, we're knocking out a lot of the side quests. And there actually is a limited amount of them. And actually, if we look at the quests list, we can actually sort by uh, completion. 
So, these are all the quests we've completed. So we're up to 94. We don't know how many there are, but you can see how many we've actually completed. So we can sort by number. So yeah, like we, we, we can get an idea of how far along we are. I don't know how many quests are total in the game, though. And no, knowing Nino Kuni 1, Nino Kuni 1 had actually a fairly extensive post game. Uh, I imagine we're probably going to be seeing that as well. Might even be able to see the doorman again. Or the, I think it was named the conductor, actually. You know, I wouldn't necessarily be surprised. Gia? Golly. It's clobbering time! Yep, it's clobbering time. Mm. Shouldn't be too bad, though. Like, yeah, it's level 37. We're almost level 50. This thing's gonna go down. Here goes nothing goes. It does a lot of damage, sure. Here goes. Ow. That was mildly unpleasant. Ow. Mildly unpleasant. Oh, you canceled my attack, you jerk. Okay, we're done. Five store away sweets. Okay. Quest complete. We'll go turn it in later. Uh, okay, so we did that. We don't know that. We don't have spirit medium yet. Okay, do we know where to get Soctopuses? Fresher, freshest. So, so it's in fish markets, basically. Okay. Can't do that yet. We do need to go do that. Uh, where... So this is an easy one. Good, knock this out real quick. Hi, you having trouble planting stuff? There's a guy downstairs who could totally help with these trees. Mm. Huh? Yeah. I'll go. I'll grab for you. Okay. So easy stuff. Yeah, we, we're basically like most of the side quests are already complete. The big thing we need to do is we need to figure out how to level up the army. Because there's a bunch of army fights that we need to do that we haven't done yet. Hey, buddy. Thank you. Plant some breathies. Yes. Okay. Growing spine shiver. All right. Okay, Thank you. We can go get one. Happens to be right outside the castle. Yeah, I mean, we're getting a lot of quests really fast, but you know there's a ton of places we haven't been. So we're going to find even more. And, whoop. There we go. Spine shivers, huh? You know, in Borderlands, the skull shivers is a bad illness, so I'm not sure how I feel about the spine shivers. Hello. Why is there just a quest in here? Hello, Boggy May. Oh! Yeah. Hmm. Oh, Gosh. that's a shame. What's going on with creatures that live here? Yeah. Whole beast with a bow has moved in and is trying to claim the place for itself. Okay, we can go deal with that. 
<sighs> okay, we'll go hunt down the thing. All right. We'll deal with the monster, and then, you know, you can come join my kingdom. It's called Prangles. Okay. We get the feline firing squad. So that's... Yeah, that's kind of odd. Because we've been here before. So, actually, that kind of irritates me. Because that means that we're going to have to go and just check random places in the hopes of finding, you know, recruits. There's places we've been before, places we've done things before. Wow, we were, we were supposed to be able to see this one a while ago, too. I am counting on you, all goes. Here goes. No. I'm wondering why we didn't see her here when we were here last. Five bots, a three-leaf store away. Okay. Well, that was easy. Where was the quest I was working on? There we go. Well. Well, no, I mean, you're, you're absolutely right. It's like the real world. But what I'm concerned about is there was... If I compare this to Radiata Stories, Radiata Stories was very similar to this in that there were a crap ton of guys you could um, collect and recruit at all times, right? So there were a ton of them. And the problem was is that certain guys you could only get at certain times in the game. If you didn't get them at the exact moment when the game offered them to you, you missed out forever. So I'm actually kind of concerned that we're going to miss out on some people because they were in a place that I didn't check at the right time in the storyline. So that's that's kind of why this concerns me, that we go to a random place and then this NPC just happens to be here when I pass through. That means there's triggers being hit that will cause uh, NPCs to show up that I wouldn't you know be able to go back for. Oh, I'm sure I've missed people. Like, all we have to do is go to the Citizen Almanac, and it will tell us, you know, we're about 50% completion right now. So, I'm missing all of these guys. I have no idea where they are or, you know, where to get them. I'm missing those guys. Like, there are people that I am missing. We can see a list. But the problem is, is that it doesn't... Right now, I have no way of figuring out where they might be. Okay, we did your thing. Huh? Yeah. Yep. Go into my kingdom. Mm. So where do you do your stuff? In a hunting lodge. That makes sense. Yeah, I, I did come here before side quests. That's absolutely true. But if you look at the level that she was, that, that her, her monster, that her monster was a level 20 monster. I'm currently doing level 45 quests. That leads me to believe that she was available a lot earlier than this. She was probably available as a, a little bit after we got the boat, which was a while ago. Hmm. Here, I have a plan for you. Well, here, I'll talk to you about it then. Here's the Greed Easy plant. Yeah. Yep, it's gonna eat up all your bad air. In a shady place. <laughs> you do the tech stuff, you do the nature stuff, Thank and you, you got a job. Much. Congratulations. Mm. All right. Congratulations, dude. 
Okay, is there any other quest that I know I can complete, like, right now? Dream Prisms, I have no idea where to get that. Can't fight him right now, because my... Okay. And we're not gonna... I don't feel like grinding out, um... I don't feel like grinding out armies right now. So, I think it's time to actually advance the storyline. Oh, you know what? We didn't check the force of, of, of Neil. Let's go check the force of Neil real quick, like, and then we'll, we'll be done. Check some miscellaneous places. Anybody in here? Does not look like it. Okay. Well, there's not a lot of, like, that's the thing. There are not a lot of miscellaneous places to check. You know, we, we say check miscellaneous places, but I could just go and fly from location to location. I could do that. But if I'm going to do that, I might as well wait till endgame. Because I don't think we're really going to see a lot of guys just kind of randomly in any of these areas. How are you? I'm curious if Mr. Hig right. Mr. Higglesworth will join you. Just make sure to ask him. How are you? Are you Higgledy? At least he has the voice, right? Okay, yeah. Uh, we're. I think we're just gonna go back to Evermore. We'll just kind of keep an eye out as we go from place to place. Okay, we should have enough money. Yep. Uh huh. Plenty of money. Let's go to our stores. Take all of our items. And our citizens. So who do we have that's new? We have Brody, who needs for who's needed at weapons. Maggie May is needed at a hunting lodge. Okay. Let's go plug her into. Go plug her in here. Okay. And let's upgrade the kingdom. Level it up. Okay, what does our kingdom look like now? I'm cu I I'm I'm excited. Hell yes! Look at this. Absolutely. New developments are available. Hell yes. Hey. So is this is this the best it gets? Like are we No, we could get better. Guys, we could get bigger. This is not the max level of the kingdom yet. The music changed too, which is kind of interesting. Okay, what else do we got? So we got a full-fledged farm, raucous ranch, massive market garden, expert explorers guild. That needs to be made. That costs a lot, though. Damn, I wish we had that kind of money. Officers training ground? More mining camps? More mining camps? Can I make this a mining camp yet? Nope. Oh, we had a lot of money for that. Evermore elite barracks? Another fish market, a bountiful bazaar, fabulous fish market, flourishing lumberyard, towering lumberyard, multi-dimensional lab, hyper hubble bubblery. Dude, this is fantastic. You're right. This is, this is a kingdom. You are absolutely right there. 
Let's uh, activate better guts getting. We've got plenty to research though. Like we got stuff to research on base level that we haven't done. So let's see about getting that research done, and then we can start getting some upgrades going. Oop. Apps. Re what do you mean, research? Oh, we don't have spiffing spiffing. Is a master of spiffing Okay, they're getting close. They're getting close. Okay. What about you guys? Master of fingers? We haven't gotten there yet. So go ahead and do that. Oh, man, this music. So good. Okay, do we want to upgrade something? Want to upgrade a bazaar? That's ninety-eight. Okay, it probably it's, it's probably gonna have to be one of our early things we upgrade in order to uh be inexpensive enough to upgrade. I don't think we have might upgrade anything else. Sure. Yeah, the music gets more epic the bigger the kingdom gets. That is actually true. Okay. New comments are available. Hell yes! Oh yes, we are gonna be the greatest. Hell yes, we are. Okay, anybody have a quest for me? Someone has a quest for me. What's up, Filipos? You can absolutely Hello. speak with me. What's up, man? You would like to learn to cook? Okay. Gosh. Yeah. Recently spent more and more time in the forest with Maggie May. See, there, there's an, it, like this connection here. Share meals if you think of hunting. Okay. Salted roast meat and unsalted roast meat. Okay. Mm. What can I do for you? Going to get the cookery and educate her palate chain. Mm. Okay, so what can we do to help you? Yeah. First thing you can do is hydropolitan stew. Okay, so we need... Mm. Okay, you know what? I bet you I already have that. Yeah, we already have hydropolitan so... stew. Here you go. Yep, you got stew. All the juices. Yeah, that's what we need here. Yeah, make a stew for everything in the forest. Thanks. Yep, you are very welcome, <laughs> sir. And it's 10,000 Kings Guilders just for doing that with him. You are very welcome. Speaking of 10,000 Kings Guilders. I am reasonably certain that 10,000 King's Guilders is actually the exact amount we need to come over here and level up our kitchen. Yeah! Hey, Floyd. Here, have some new recipes. Are you ready to order? Oh, absolutely, I'm ready to order. Let's, uh, what can we make? that we haven't made before. Ooh, gotta fly flakes. That sounds fantastic. And let's also make a shot of salad. Okay, I can't make... Oh, get up and go nuts. Gotta make those. And he upgrades level five. Awesome. Oh, that means we can do double down dumplings. Anything else we can make? Now we gotta get some of these ingredients, man. Take your time. See ya! Okay, thank you, Floyd. You're awesome. Anything else we gotta do? Nope. Okay, guys, let's actually go. <laughs> actually, no, we haven't been here in a while. Oh, crap. Pyre Pillar? Okay, does Roland have anything else? He has Static Squall. Can we make Static Squall? We can. Let's let's give him Static Squall. So now he knows that. 
Speaking of love with the static wall and a little bit more, maybe get a new spell out of it, because I think... Yeah, if we, if we can get Static Wall to level 10, all of a sudden he gets that third tier. F hey, look, you do not insult Floyd's bread. Awesome, level 10. And now we can learn Static Storm. I don't know how we don't know how to do that yet, but you know what? That's fine. Let's see. What can you learn? Fireball, Pyre Pillar. You can learn Static Wall as well. I like the idea of Pyre Pillar. I mean, we're gonna look at this stuff later on. I'm not gonna do it now. But man, like there's some there's some serious stuff we can learn. Okay, let's figure out what Leander has to tell us. I'm excited to look inside our new cup. Wow! Guys, we have an actual throne room! This is exciting! Like, I know we had, like, a throne hut and a throne chamber. Now we have a throne room. Like, this is exciting. Okay, what's up, Leander? If I may be so bold... Maybe it'll play freely for a while after this point. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's proceed. I'm glad it tells me there's a point of no return coming. Okay, so what's up? Here it comes, ready? No. So what's up? I'm selling news from within the kingdom. Reports of certain resources being unaccounted for and of a suspicious hooded character having been cited. Among several developments have become cause for some concern. Yeah. Shady sort to boot. A thief among our number. Nope, that's not good. And Batu looks right over uh -huh. here at Roland, who, uh, like, slowly responds. Golly. Okay, who is this robed person? Yeah. He obviously mm. doing the one ceiling, obvious. Uh, we probably no, could need better here. security, but... Yep. Let's figure out how mm. to find this guy. Yep, let's figure him out. No. Roland can't make it? Roll in. Mm. Come on, dude. Thanks. Yeah, I'm I'm concerned. I. And uh, it looks like Batu is kind of concerned as well. Actually, he just looks upset. I'm upset too. Roland, what you doing, man? Uh oh. Oh, I'm seriously concerned about what's going on over here. You have my thanks. Okay, what do you need, Rogue uh -huh. Man? No. Okay. What? A fledgling realm populated by bandits and vagabonds? Excuse me? I don't like that smile. Wait, what, what, what the, what is this? Like, this is not what I expect from Roland. Well. Join you where? What the hell's going on? Man, I want to know what's going on here. Batu looks kind of upset about this whole thing. So, Roland, get up to much last night, did you? Meet with any interesting characters? Here come the accusations. Last night? I don't know what you're talking about. Dude, he saw you! Spare as you lies. You're a traitor, man. Fixing to leave our little kingdom behind for bigger and better. Don't bother to deny it. Okay, so here we, here's where we go. Here's, here's where we know things. Surely not. What's going on here? Surely so, lad. 
Or did he think it a coincidence that our precious resources only go missing on this treacherous dog's watch? Okay, let's tone down the language a little bit. Let's at least give him a chance to defend himself. And what are the shady fella in the cloak he met with this past evening? Just an old pal come for a chinwag, was he? That is, I mean, that is a legitimate question, Roland. What's up? I'd like to hear you explain that little lot away, Mr. President. Please let us know what's going on, Roland. Talk to us. There must be some mistake. Mustn't there, Leander? Come on, man. What's One going on here? One should not rush to judgment on the basis of hearsay alone, but I must say, this does seem somewhat irregular. Come on, Roland. Speak to us, man. What? There you have it. Now sling your rook before I sling it for you, you scurvy swine. Man, Bacha's being all kinds of aggressive. Let the man speak. So that's how much trust I've earned, huh? Good to know. Maybe I would be better off someplace else. Uh, that's not the defense someplace I was hoping. Someplace my talents will be appreciated. Um, he as good as admits it. Yeah, he didn't admit, really admit anything. He's upset that you were accusing him of shit. So long, Batu. Evan. And Roland's just, just gone. Roland! You can't! Not even the slightest attempt to defend himself. One cannot help but wonder if Batu's suspicions were well-founded. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of curious myself. No! Like, what's going on? Roland just decides to just walk through the fields? Like... Well, now. And who is this dude? He looks familiar. He's He is suspicious. That is absolutely true. He already knows what's going on. Quite useful to us, huh? Mm. I don't really... <laughs> King Mousinger. Okay. Huh. Okay, so what I'm really hoping is this is a ploy to get him in with King Mousinger or something like that. But I'm kind of worried. Like, Roland was the character I really enjoyed probably most of all because he's so selfless and helping. So if... Like, this just... Ugh. What the nonsense, man. Blimey. Yeah, I don't know if he's... I don't know if he's coming back, Tony. I'm, I'm kind of... I'm not happy about this. Oh. Man. I mean, I can't help but feel that this is... You know... Gut punches stories. What? Well, so, look. When, when, when I talk about gut punches, well, let's just see what's going on here. I like that eyebrow raise. Ding dong, Del Castle. Things have changed a little bit here. So, when I was talking about gut punches, remember, what I was talking about is a thing done for no other reason than to get you to react that has no kind of basis in the story itself. They've been building this up for a little while, so we kind of knew it was coming. The reason we don't know is why. And I think it's a gut punch if we don't get a why. It's just, it's done purely for the sake of having an emotional effect. So what we need is more information, like what exactly is going on here. Okay, so we're we're still playing as Roland. Like we are we are still here as Roland. Now I think we're gonna switch Roland back to his guard's great coat because, you know. Things have changed a little bit. Check the upgraded trail. Like I'm I, what I'm really hoping is that this is Roland's way of trying to get more information from other other places. But I guess we'll find out. But this, just, this doesn't seem to fit in this with, with his character, which is why I don't like him. I, so far as we've seen, Roland is nothing if not a, you know, loyal, helpful person. Mm. So I'm just 
again, this, this is surprising as if that basis in the story or character, and that's what gets me so, like, what the hell is up here? Oh, hello. Well, I mean, the map looks explorable. No. Ah, oh, no, actually, it looks like Roland is not going to even allow us to. Looks like we can't necessarily go anywhere. <laughs> yeah, what I'm what I'm seeing here is that there's no there's no exploration allowed. Well, I could kind of see the I, I could kind of see the argument. No. Yeah. I kind of see the argument that Roland is, um, you know, he does want to go home. He has he has things to do. You know, apparently he has a kid. He has it sounds like he has a wife. Um, there's stuff for him to do. But so far that we've seen the story, Roland has been a kind of duty first type of guy. He understands he has things he needs to do before he can go home if he can go home. So. Nothing I've seen with Roland seems to be based on greed, money, compensation. You know, he see, he, he's always seemed to be like duty for duty's sake. You know, help other things like that. The things he's trying to get Evan to learn. So to see him just walk away from Evan, just it's it's completely counterintuitive to Roland as a player or as a character. So I have to assume something else is going on here. Greetings. Yeah, hi, Messenger. How's it going? Well, well, well. This is Chancellor Vermine, you know, jerk. An almost viable ruler of King Evan. Yeah. <laughs> Very flattered. Okay, so what's up? So what type of arrangement are we going for? All right. Now, one of the things I am kind of curious of, is this an example of, like, the Horned One's minions acting on one of our guys? So I'm curious if we're going to see Roland with darkness coming out of him by the end of this section. He's power, maybe a little money. See, that is completely contrary to Roland as a character so far, though. Even get him heaven? <laughs> Forgive me. So prove yourself, okay. A little test in the dungeons to see if he'll actually do what he says he will. Hmm. Hmm. So now the game is allowing me to move around a little bit more. The so dungeons are that way. Is there anything? Okay, so I'm not going to be able to go in this direction. You're going to stop me. Okay, we can't go that way. Like, as, like, greed is a great motivator for evil, but you, you can tell when someone is focused on money or power or fame or kind of some of those other forms of evil, but you can also when someone isn't, you know, when someone is not interested in that. And so far as we've seen, Roland, as characterized by the game, is not he doesn't want that stuff like nothing he does is to get him stuff he wants others to get things 
So when you know, usually when we see him, whenever he's given you know law, uh, you know, uh, you know, credit for something or lauds, he just says no, 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 that's not as much me. That's that's the team. You know, that's. So I don't see, I don't see this, especially when he comes out and says it. Just, I want power. I want money. Yeah, it's not really any place to explore. I'm gonna go check the storeroom real quick, but I am seeing there's a. There's a person right in front of it, something's the way to go. What what I'm what I'm really hoping for, the direction I'm hoping this goes, is that Roland sees that money and power are the two things that would drive Mousinger. And that would be the easy way to get Mousinger to You know, say yes and also accept Roland. Yeah, it looks like I can't go this way either. Um there, there's a uh, Gia. There, there's no exploration allowed. There's just nothing to do. Okay. So what's the test? Sure. Oh dear. I see a person on the far side. Huh? Oh, who is that? What? Oh crap. Master Roland! Yeah, see, some people still appreciate you. you. You're one of Batu's men. Aye, that I am. Kumbish is the name. He's traveled with you. You fought side by side. This gentleman was apprehended after being observed behaving suspiciously in our airspace. It is our belief that he is a spy. Eh, probably not. He's not Curse you, stuff. you devils. Didn't I say already? I was looking for Master Roland. For hmm. me? Why? <laughs> Forgive me, Your Honor. Seems I made a blunder. Uh, a little bit, just just a tiny bit. <laughs> you sure did. And why am I not surprised? Like Roland's acting all evil, but I mean. Now, Mr. Crane, to our test. Let us see where your allegiance truly lies. Messenger, you know she have no guards with you. Dispatching one of your former allies should provide us with adequate proof that you are ready to serve a new master. Oh man, I don't like this. No, no. Listen here, you rat face swab, you. Is something the matter? Surely you are capable of such a straightforward show of commitment. Oh, God. Or could it be that we have an imposter in our midst? Dude, you're standing there alone. He could just shoot you. He has a gun. Don't get ahead of yourself. Let's just say I prefer to use my own methods. Okay, so I'm a little bit more hopeful for Roland right now. Master Roland, no! We're shipmates! You, you can't just... Sorry. It's nothing personal. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Ah! Curse you for the traitor you are! Ah! <laughs> Happy now? I mean... Happy enough? I don't... Like, I'm hopeful that there's things that were done that just... Hmm. I don't yeah. know. Puh. Batu, can you stop being a jerk? But, but... I'm hoping it's a strategy of his. I don't like how Leander's being so cold about this. Forgive me. What? 
Okay. Bracken, what do you feel about this? What? Yeah, like five minutes ago. Like in real time, five minutes ago, who's a best friend? Oh. 